Hey guys, this is the 696 baby and uh, today I'm gonna show you how you can make uh, you saw the spears and the spinning things going on Then I made the intro for faith and uh, I got a lot of requests on how to make this so let's go ahead and make it happen and uh, you know my render setting 1280 720 HD and let's go grab a um, sphere and we want us we need a tube also now for the tube I can show you how to scale it and how to do all that but it's gonna take more time which is time that I don't have so I'm just gonna show you the numbers that you can put here and get you the same thing that I did first you're gonna make the inner radius to 100 point uh, 844 which should get you this and for the out radius Yeah, for the out radius, you want to make it, uh, let's say, 100.105, and for the height, you want to make it um, 26.87. And you're gonna get this shape, all right? No signs, nothing. All right, and go to slice. Check this box, and you're gonna get half of two, half two. So, all right. Then you go to my graph, grab a clonal object, to uh, gr uh, drag the tube to the clonal object. Go to the clonal object setting, object, and make the movement we want our movement to be zeros so make it zero and fucking messenger pissing me off and you wanna go to slice so make it 1 1.3 1.3 1.3 I mean 103 103 and you wanna go to here also and make it 55 55 55 and you're gonna get this and then and now we're gonna need a random effector for to have random movements and all this crazy things that we saw alright random effector Make sure you select the colonial object and grab random effector. Go to the random effector setting. And we don't want position. The only thing we need is rotation. Make the first uh, rotation, uh, let's say 50. And second one also 50. The third one also 50 and go to the first key uh, timeline make it 250 and make a keyframe select the three positions and control and click on this circle in this circle and it's gonna make a keyframe and go to the end and also make another keyframe so keyframe at zero and keyframe at uh, 250 all right which is gonna be here now we want to play with the numbers more so we get some rotation because if we hit play from the beginning nothing happened so we want to have some randomness so we go to about let's say uh, 140 141 actually and we change the number and rotation and make it let's say 720 for the first one second one 512 
uh, sorry, 720, second, 512, third one, 400, 420, I don't know, 400, whatever you want, just to have randomness, and control click, and if we go to the beginning, voila, and we have our rotation and randomness and all that crazy thing. And now I'm gonna make this tutorial two part because I don't know, it's just one part won't be enough. So let's go ahead and stop right here because we only have one more step than we done. So let's stop over here and we'll show you what you're gonna do in the next time. I mean, let's see if I have time or not. Let me check. Actually, yep, I guess I have time to finish something. All right. Um, and now we want to do another thing also to have more randomness and the spinning tubes and all that we can we can actually move this one from the keyframe that we made in 141 we can move it to about 90 about 90 all right and we can move one one keyframe or two. I like to move it two keyframes. And oh, actually, let's move it once and make another keyframe. Actually, all right. Control click on the circles, and you're gonna have runs up. And now move it to about. Oh no. 180 something like that and if we hit play we're gonna have more randomness and it's like slow go slow fast then slow then it go back fast and it's just I think it's make it more sexier like this with the movement and all that anyway in the next uh, tutorial the part two uh, we're gonna be making the the outside like the cover of these sides and it's like the be it's like a big tubes these two a big one just on the side just to cover it I don't know it's more crazy but for the next one you're gonna need a plugin called make thicker and I swear to God, guys, I looked everywhere for this plugin, so I can put a link for it in the description. I couldn't find this shit, I swear to God. I couldn't find it. I looked everywhere, and I couldn't find it. I don't know how the fuck did it get in, and my, like, plugins set. I don't know, for some reason, I found this, like, bam, make thicker. I was like, what the fuck is make thicker? And it's just right here, I don't know. So, I hope you guys, you know, just Google for it. A called Make Thicker plugin. Just Google for it. I think you will find it. And, yep, that's about it. And I will see you in the next uh, tutorial. It'll be part two. Thanks for watching. Peace.